Hi, I'm Megan. Let's talk about how to use sales accountability. First, we'll talk about my care and setting up your sales activities. Let's dive right in. At the heart of sales accountability is this concept of care. Care stands for keep, attain, recapture, and expand. Keep is all about maintaining your current client base, as well as preventing from threats or people leaving you. Attain is all about your new business and your prospecting. Recapture is all about getting back business you may have lost. And expand is all about growing your current customer base. This behavior segmentation allows salespeople and sales managers to develop specific and custom activity plans for their prospects, for their clients, and see really where you're spending your time so you can ultimately be more efficient throughout your workday. So let's walk through how you're gonna actually set that up. So go ahead and click on My Care, and it's gonna bring you to this screen. It's gonna give you a couple tips here at the top about how the points are broken down and how to actually set these behaviors, but don't worry, it's very simple. So you can have as many behaviors under every category or as few behaviors under every category as you prefer. This is completely customizable. Now, if you're in a more uh, hunter type of role or newer to sales and you don't have any current clients, you might have a completely attain profile. You might have all of your behaviors under attain, and that's completely fine. If you're a veteran or if you're in a more account manager type role, you might have a more well-rounded care profile with activities under every category. That's fine too. So when you're gonna add a behavior, all you're gonna do is click the add button and on the left here, you're gonna see some suggestions based on your industry. You can use these suggestions or not, totally up to you. For this example, let's just click on an activity that's here. But again, if you want to name this something else, just enter the activity name. Now I'm gonna set the frequency. So what is my goal? How many of these activities or this activity do I want to do either per day, per week, per month or per year. So let's go with three, how about a week? Now when I set the value here, the frequency, it's gonna give me a point value. It's a little over 23 points. So remember, our goal every day is to get to at least, 100, at least to 100 points or more. So three times a week, my goal is to get this activity done. So if this value makes sense, you can absolutely go with it. However, if that seems like too high or too low, all you have to do is click Use Custom Value and enter any value between 1 and 100, let's say 10. So now, every time I hit this activity on my dashboard, it's going to give me 10 points. Press OK, and then you're done. That's all you have to do under every category. Next, we're going to talk about how to navigate through your dashboard.